Welcome back to another vlog. Today we are doing something which I've wanted to do for absolutely ages. Like actually I've been talking about this since we moved to Berlin and we've been here 13 months. Wait, what's the date today, Jamie? It's actually 13 months since we've been here, like in like two days time, I think. That's actually insane that we haven't done this thing yet. What I'm talking about is renting out a bicycle and cycling down Tempelhofeld, which is the outdoor airport which isn't an airport anymore. It's just like a big park. You might've seen it before. It's really, really cool because you can actually cycle the whole way down the runway and you can also walk it, but it's like two kilometers, isn't it? Did you just say it? outdoor airport? Outdoor airport, yeah. As opposed to an indoor airport. Airports are indoor as well, Jamie. But wait. If you don't have anything nice to add, get out of- How, could, how could an airport be inside? <laughs> if the whole thing was inside, how could the planes take off? Anyway. <laughs> the runways, there's like two runways and they're like two kilometers long each and we've walked them before but walking them is really boring because it's basically just tarmac yeah, and I've really always, cool. always wanted to cycle them. So that's what we're doing today. It's only like five euro to rent a bike for two hours so we're going to go and cycle. I'm so excited to take you guys with us and it's a beautiful sunny day. It's only 19 degrees so that's actually good because sometimes it can reach 30 here and that's just way too hot because you're just like sweating all the time whereas now it's like a nice blue sky and it's like normal weather and yeah anyway haven't vlogged in ages just wanted to update you guys that what I've been doing is working flat out on my book lately. It's out on the 20th of August. I'm so excited for you guys to finally see it. Like I didn't even realize how good it would be when I started. And I'm not saying that like to be big headed about it. I'm saying like I put a lot of work into it, which I didn't think, I, I thought it was gonna be like a 10 page short guide. It's like currently like 65 pages. Um, so yeah, Jamie's read some of it though. Yeah, it actually is good. And I'm not just saying that because Colette would hit me if I said it was bad. It actually is really good. Yeah, I think it's good as well. And it's just something I'm proud of. Like I've put work into it to make sure it is good because I want it to be good quality for you guys and also helpful. Basically, if you, this is the first video you've watched of mine, it's a book about happiness, like how to improve your mental health, how to improve your life um, and all of that. But also it's based loosely around like eating disorders because it's based around my own experience, but it's not like a how to recover from eating disorders book. It's more general where it will actually have something that applies to every single person in it because you found it useful as well definitely yeah and you've never had an eating disorder so nope. so yeah it's for everyone so yeah let's get going i'm so excited jamie's treating me to a bicycle today <laughs> i'm not cycled anything. can i have a pink one no th none of them are pink anyway mm -hmm. i haven't cycled in like a year and we're gonna get oh. some really cute shots i told jamie i want some movie shots of me like cycling past yeah. laughing with my wind blowing in my hair with my hair blowing in the wind when's the last time you cycled I don't know, Jamie. When's the last time you cycled? Yeah, that's what I was just saying, like over a year ago, I think. Yeah, but well, I still know how to cycle, like. You sure you haven't forgot? Yeah, I'm positive. I might be a wee bit wobbly at first, but oh, I know no. how to do it. Yeah. Let's go. So we just got off the U-Bahn. We're at where we're getting the bikes. These are from the company, what's it called? Donkey? Donkey Republic. Donkey Republic. They're bright orange. I'm gonna show you one. We're just about to unlock this one. Well, it's gonna be one of these, but we have to find one of them. One of them that we can actually unlock. Um, so I'm not sure. We'll figure it but out. Yeah. Pretty cool. And they have a, oh my God, yeah. the seats are on fire. Would you like to do the honors? Rent now for 10 euro. That's for two of them for two hours. Rent now for 10 euro. Yeah. So my bike has been unlocked. And now I have to try and like, you know, I haven't ridden a bike in a year. So I'm trying to figure out what to do with this lock. I'm just gonna try and attach it to the bike. But yeah, I'm number 1439 for the day. <laughs> All right, Kalada, you ready to get on the bike? I'm actually scared that I'm gonna fall off of this. Why okay, you're not gonna fall off. You're gonna be fine. <laughs> You've adjusted my seat as low as it goes as well. It could it could still go lower if you really needed to. It can't. No? Oh my gosh. Oh, my oh you're gosh. fine, you haven't died, you haven't died. Anyone watching this is gonna be like, what is wrong with you? You're honestly doing fine. Yeah, my skirt is right, this dress is actually not the best. <laughs> Like very graceful. Okay, I'm on. Oh my god. I'm so proud of you. Yeah, I don't know if I can press how many years actually scary. I used to cycle every single day. <laughs> Off to Temple Hopper we go to the airport. <laughs> Bye forever, Colette. So here we are, we're actually at 
the original like airport entrance. I've never been to this entrance before. We've never been here before. So this is the actual like entrance to the terminal where um, people would have went in uh, when this was still an active airport. Imagine that this was still an active airport. It would have been so close to our apartment. It would have been amazing. It would have been very convenient. I mean, Colette's I mean, actually on the bike, by the way. Look, I mean, you're doing fine. Guys, I completely forgot that I love cycling. If, yeah. If you've actually watched me for a while, you'll know that I used to go cycling every single day after work when I was on my placement year, like the first year that I was on YouTube. Um, and I love it so much. I still have a bike at home in Ireland, so I'll have to like get a new bike or get or use that one or something. I'm, really, I'm also really... cycling, and like check out this like I know, view this I've got so here. Cool. Yeah, look, I mean, I've got my phone on here. This is a good bike. Aha, nice. Also, it's worth pointing out we're actually cycling on the footpath because I'm scared shitless of all the cars. Yeah, see, like, look, this is where we are. You're not <laughs> meant to do this, like, by the way. I don't care. I've seen other people do it. Yeah, I'm gonna call the police. Bye, Colette. Oh, oh, Film me gracefully cycling off into the tree. Don't crash, or die. <laughs> Colette is struggling to go in here. I don't know why she's cycling along this walkway, but she's doing it. So behind me, you can see the map of Flug Flughafen. Is that how you say Flughafen Tempelhof? Which so. is Tempelhof Airport. So you can see that we are here where the red dot is and we're just going to cycle the whole way up all the runways. Um, there's actually much more beyond this map. This is the map of just the airport, but we're obviously going to the there's runways. Oh my God, cool. We're, we're here. That's the main oh my gosh, I'm so excited. <laughs> down the runway first time in my life how did it feel jamie it's pretty cool jamie forgot to remind me that there's gears on a bike right i knew there was gears obviously but i thought they were for like when you're going uphill and stuff so we were like we'll have a race and jamie was so far ahead and i was putting all of my energy in and i was in first gear and i was like i cannot catch up and my feet were like flying off the pedals and i was like out of breath and then jamie's like why do you not use the gears and i was like oh like so i actually just like really exhausted myself for no reason i just assumed that you would have Forgot about gears. But that's that's like you know if you're like I didn't know there was pedals on the bike. I thought I just had to like sit there and wobble and. No. Uh whatever. Red so yeah, we ha we only have the bikes left for another like half an hour. So we're just gonna cycle around, and then yeah. sadly we have to return them. But I think at five euro for two hours is actually really good. I'd highly recommend that you come and do this because it's actually really fun. Yeah, I don't know if it's easier to go and rent a bike here, but I just found this app and I like apps. Yeah. Well, I've seen you can rent bikes, but they're like twelve euro for a day and stuff. Yeah, these guys. This was ten euro for a day. Ten a day. But I wouldn't want it for a day. It's too long. Who is with me on the fact that putting your feet on the grass, like your bare feet, is like the best thing in the world? Honestly, I don't think anything else beats it. I'm just sitting here in the grass. It's so so nice. It just makes me feel good. You ready to go? Do you want to cycle down the other way now? Yeah, we'll go that way because we just came from we just came from this way, so I think we'll go that way. Also, there's just really nice allotment here. Let's go. We made it back in the two hours. I've had fun on this bike. You have to connect to this lock by Bluetooth. So it's doing it now. It's ending the rental. It's checking to actually lock the bike to something. That's so strange. It's good though. 
it's actually overly complicated. Any other time there's been, I've used the bike rental thing, they just have a station and you like put the bike into it and that's it. Yeah, but these ones can be dropped anywhere, that's why. I guess. But anyway, I've had fun. Would recommend. <laughs> Bluetooth bikes. So we just got back and both of us, whenever we were walking down the stairs, we were like jelly legged, even though we didn't cycle that long. We were cycling like two hours. But honestly, because we hadn't done it in so long and then we were like going at full speed down the runway, it was like, uh oh, haven't used these muscles in a while. Anyway, I hope you liked this video. I hope that you found it enjoyable. And if you come to Berlin, you definitely should go to Temple Hopper. It's so, so cool there. Uh, we had a great day. It's still really early. It's only like four o'clock or something. But I'm gonna work for the rest of the day and just get stuck into finishing this book for you guys. I'm really, really, really excited, but it's out so, so soon and I still have not finished. So a bit stressful and need to go and do that. But yeah, thanks for watching. Make sure to stay subscribed. Stay subscribed, make sure to subscribe or stay subscribed. Yeah, just do both those things. <laughs> um, and yeah, Jamie, have you had a good day? Yeah, it was all right. Yeah, it was good. <laughs> He's just enjoying his crisps and Fritz cola. Oh, I actually have Fritz yeah, as well. A sugar-free Fritz. And yeah, say bye. 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 Thanks so much, guys, for watching. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.